Now the third part of this video clip is how to create your own loop rig. Now for that, I'll just use my preferred hook, which is a crank. And I'm going to be taking the Corda Supernatural. And I'm going to literally just for the sake of this cut about a 28 centimeter piece of braid off. Take that out of the way. And I'm now going to just create the, the, the hair part. So for that, I'm folding the line double. And I just make a double overhand knot once and twice. There we go. My puller tool, pull it nice and tight. and cut off the tag end. There we go. Cool. We've got the hair. Now I take my my bait. Put the bait on. Pull it through. Put my bait stop on. And now I determine the length of the hair. Now for this particular rig, you want the bait to not go past the bend. If it's going past like that, it's too much. I want to pull it back just slightly because I just want it to touch there. Just like that. Right. Now I take the loose end and I push that through the eye of the hook as well because I need to now create a loop end and I've worked it out that if you take at least five and a half centimeters of loop you create exactly the right length that you're looking for there it is let me just give it a little bit more five and a half so now I literally take that and remember that the open end of the hook is facing you. It's away from me. So I will be turning this way around. If you are right-handed, you will have the hook in your left hand and you will be working towards you, right? So all I'm going to do is, it's one, two, three, four, and five. I'm literally making a five turn knotless knot and then I just hook the braid there we go onto my braid needle and I pull it through there we go pull it tool and I pull nice and tight and I make sure that the hair exits the back of the hook. All that I now need to do is cut off this tag end over there. Just hold it nice and tight. There we go. And there we go. I've got it made. Now I take the boom that I've just created earlier on. open that up again I've still got a piece of putty in there there we go there we go it's a bit of a finicky job especially if you make the loop a little bit too small but the ultra fine bait needle does the job for you so now I'm just going to take the bait off. I don't need that anymore for now. I fold it over itself again. Like so. Just push my hair through there. Come on. There we go. 
I'm going to call it dot. Now there is the one I've created. And here is the one from the packet. Almost identical. 